What is up? What is up? What is up? All right, today we are going to be doing some more games. I'm still on that grind. I am determined to get all my ratings over 1,500 because that's where I should be. I'm very disappointed in myself for not being there already. And while we play, we'll be enjoying some chest berries. Chest berries are a lot like blueberries, except for you eat them while playing chess. Let's get warmed up with a couple of my favorite unrated games. So we're going to play some unrated 5 minute blitz and kind of see if I can not suck. We'll see what I'm playing today. Alright, what we got? I'm black. This looks like a very fair fight. Very similarly rated. Playing the freaking Queen's Gambit, because that's all anybody plays. Which means I have to play Nimzo Indian all the time. Mm. I've never really cared about that move, and I'm still not going to care about it. Plus, I get the power of chest berries. The power of uh, chest berries commands you. Hmm. 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 I really want to cap this guy for some reason. But I know that is incorrect and I'm not going to do it. Let's go ahead and give this guy a kick. Let's go ahead and give this guy a double kick. Let's go ahead and... Fix this? I don't love that. Hmm. I love it when I play weird things that I'm super uncomfortable with. K Flizzy, what's up, bruv? What is up, bruv? Oh, that's gonna be ugly. Takes with pin or takes with motivation. That was the incorrect move. He done messed up, son. He done messed up a lot. Look at my bishop has this wide open shot at the king side. Oh, I'm gonna just rain on his parade, son. Raindrops. Raindrops. Raindrops, run away. What's his game plan here? Take. Castle. What's his game plan? What you got? Okay, Flizzy. Oh, how was Bobby stream? Did you tell him to play me in chess? I'm pretty sure that was like your only job, bro. Was to tell him to play me in chess. Uh, do I want to trade queens? Because I really don't, but I don't think I have a choice. Alright, what are we looking at? His pawns are jacked up. This we know to be a truth. Let's go ahead and use that against him. He's got a white square bishop, I have a white square bishop. He's really going for that big trade, huh? Oh, I wanted to hit him with a check. Guess not today, huh? But we'd be trading. Oh, he's trying to get that pawn advantage. Okay. Um. Okay. I'm gonna keep chasing you, bro. Look at that king development. Oh, I'm stuck. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. Where do I want to be? This is a weakness. I guess let's push here. 
Barney Claptrap. Bro, all the time. If you want to hit up a challenge, let me know. I love a good rando challenge. Love it. It's one of my greatest joys. One of my greatest joys in the world. Let's go ahead and lock this up. I'm in a huge time disadvantage. So Barney, um, I got some links on my profile. You can see all my uh, accounts. Just let me know when and where, baby. When and where. But I only play unrated. As much as I can, at least. It's kind of my jam. Here? I think that's correct. He has to play opposition. Has to. Opposition me, son. Hey, Barney, do you play on uh, chess.com or are you a lead chess guy? Which one do you prefer? Look at me dominating these dark squares. Aww. That's almost checkmate. That dude almost checkmate me with a freaking bishop. That would have been heartbreaking. All right, what do we do here? Check. I don't have any pass to get past him. Does he have pass to get past me? You gonna run, son? No, I don't think so. This is gonna come down to. Ha! Huh. I'm cool with that, Barney. If you wanna play me, though, like I said, uh, hit me a follow and then send me a challenge. Oh, this feels risky. Should I take it? I think I have no choice. I take, he pushes. If I don't take him, he goes there. I think I just lost this, boys. I think I just lost this. Oh, what did I just do? What did I just do? I'm getting smoked, man. I'll tell you that right now. If I cap this pawn here... Dude's gonna get me. Uh, okay, let's go for a stalemate. Alright, boy, we rocking chest berries. Let's go. Oh, he just GG'd me. I'll GG him back. He's definitely playing it smart. Alright, first warm up game. Got smoked. This guy. Barney, you're in 1900? You're ridiculous, sir. Alright, Barney, I'm gonna play you. But you need to throw me a follow. Where'd you go? I saw you for two seconds. Where'd you go? I was gonna let you beat me up. There we go. Gotcha. All right, Barney. Get me good, bro. You better throw me a follow after you smoke me in front of the entire universe. Good luck, man.
Barney's a class act, I can tell you right now. Class act bloke. All right, class act, what are we gonna do here? Let's put a little pressy press here. Let's look at what's happening. Stay mindful, my friends. Kinda of thought this pin might come one day. Do we have a plan for this pin though? Because I don't think we did. I think it goes a little something like boom, boom. Nope. We're in trouble already. And this is what happens when you play in 1900. Did I miss something? No. Okay. Let's fix the problem. So our ultimate goal here is to not lose the queen or get forked. And we failed. We failed our one goal. We had one we had one job. We had one job. Alright, let's play against a 1900 without a queen. Let's see how that goes. Six hundred's pretty close. Dude, I'm just stepping on landmines. I'm stepping on landmines. Constantly. Alright, man. There's no way I can come back from this. I'm gonna resign, and I'm gonna rematch you. Let's go. That was a good game, man. You're, you're very strong. Let's run it back. I love it. I love it. Chess is a beautiful game. I'm gonna have these more chess berries. I have not consumed nearly enough for this challenge that I'm undergoing currently. All right, so my guy, dang, he's good. All right, so we have to take with knight because rook is taking this pawn. All right, rook just claps that pawn. All right, let's do a little bit of a prophylactic move here. Okay, let's go ahead and get hit with this freaking beautiful check. Don't redeem on me, not yet. Give me a minute. Let me get settled, bro. Let me figure out how to play chess. Um, what do we want here? Our goal is going to be not to lose this bishop. That'd be great. His bishop is here on g6. We would like... What would we like to happen? What would we like to happen? Bam, bam. All right, let's just go ahead and slide here. We've given him plenty of time to figure out his path to success. He's got a pin on this knight, that's dirty. Let's go ahead and rock it here. Is this the move? We can't allow that pin 
to live forever. Okay, blam blam. I see, I see, I see. Let's go ahead and try and slide back, create some space. He wants to bust the sensor open, makes sense. But we need something with a higher impact than that. Here we go, he's winning a piece again. And I already know what he's gonna do. He's gonna fork me. He's gonna hit me with another sick fork, like the kids do. This guy is relentless. That was surprising. I guess he's going for uh, King's, trying to destroy my King's safety as opposed to anything else. So I'm down a piece. What am I gonna do about it? It takes takes, ugly. Uh, this, mm. Well, I'll tell you what, we need something. Because what we're doing right now is not working. All current plans are trash. We're going full forky, boys. Full forky. Never look back. All right, how do we make this work? This is a huge problem, and it's only going to get worse. Uh, I think... Man, our light score weaknesses are so bad here. Okay, so we do that, we do that, we die. This is rough. This is rough. Just the way your mother likes it. Matthew Murdoch. Who's throwing kisses? I want to kiss. I want to kiss. Man, so many weaknesses. So little time. Okay, so how am I going to deal with this current? Crap shoot. Bam, 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 bam. Bam, 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 bam. We could do a take, take situation. We could do a 19 second situation. All right, it's fine. Okay, I see the plan. I see what you're doing, and I don't appreciate it. Is that the idea? Bro, all right. Dude, I'm down to keep rolling. If you want to keep hulking me, I have no problem getting hulked. I love it. I love getting hulked. Let's go. Let's just be wild, son. Be aggressive. Be e aggressive. I'm gonna play the kind of moves that you've never seen before because they're terrible. Let's 
Where's he going? Where's he going? Where does he stop? Nobody knows. We have ideas. Let's go ahead and be... Knock another prophylactic move. That did not work for me last time. It's not going to work for me this time. Let's keep being aggressive. He is what you would call a psychic. Spawn Archangel. I don't know what all those symbols mean, but I'm pretty sure it means that I'm getting clapped. And you're not wrong. Alright, Bishop's flying up on me here. I don't like it. Let's go ahead and try something else aggressive. What else have we got? What else is aggressive? Nothing. Maybe? Maybe something? Uh, I don't love my thoughts right now. Let's go with here. Looking for ideas. Where's this knight going, do we know? Besides attacking my queen. Obviously. Right, let's try to keep some distance. Knight is offering a little bit of defense, but we are playing. All right, Barney. Hey, appreciate the follow, by the way. You're a solid player. If you want to beat me up anytime you see me online, I'm down for it. I'm always down to learn something. Oh, good. K Flash is back, dude. I was worried, man. Solidly concerned. Playing some soups aggressive chess. Really hoping it pays off at some point. Odds are no. Odds are very much in the favor of it not paying off ever. Do a little rook lift action. Let's see what happens with the rook lift. Logan's clothing stream. You know, I've been wondering about that. I heard it was pretty fly. For a white guy. Let's just keep on hammering. Hammering away. Lock things up. Hammer, hammer, hammer. So does Logan spend more time in the V-neck or out of the V-neck? Like that's really gonna be the deciding factor for me. Huh. Let's try this. Do we like this move? Do we hate this move? Is this the worst move we've ever seen? I don't know. We're going to try and make as many of these moves as we can. So he's trying to force a queen trade here, which means that he likes my position. 
I knew I should have pushed this F pawn at some point. Maybe I push it now. Now? Maybe that's too aggressive? I don't know. I don't know how to play chess. I just work here. Which mirror? Corey's mirror? Is it Corey's mirror that you're talking about? So I hear that's a very popular mirror. So I don't love that. We're about to start losing pawns, boys. Ah, he really wants this queen trade. What a rascal. What can we do with this? What can we do with this? Not a lot. Okay. So if this is what we're going to work with, this is what we're going to work with. I'm gonna run out of time again, but this is a much better game. It's way more interesting than the last one. Yeet. What's our game plan here, guys? Not get checkmated? I'm cool with that. I had 0 0.04 seconds left. I was pre-moving like a boss. Yeah, Barney. Barney, it was really good, man. Yeah, I knew you had to trade queens. You found such a awesome way to force the queen trade. That was a really excellent uh, force. I usually hate those closed positions, like when the position's super closed. Uh, I get really uncomfortable. And so I didn't really know how to handle it. But uh, I think I should have pushed F3 much earlier. Like before your bishop came in. If I would have pushed F3, let's say here, instead of doing this, instead of doing queen G4, if I would have pushed F3, do you think that would have been all right? Oh, dude. Hold on, let's analyze this game. Chess.com says I missed a win. That says I missed a win. That is very uncomfortable to think about. Why won't this work? But they said I missed a win, and it's very likely that I did. All right, so let's check out the analysis board. Uh, you could have played queen h5, then rook h3 before taking the pony. Let's check it. So. The analysis says that, man, we played a terrible game, bro. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> According to the chess.com analysis, I had 56.1% accuracy. You had 65.2% accuracy. Um, we both had 17 of the best moves. I had 12, 
Uh, you had 12 excellent moves. I had nine excellent. I had nine good. You had eight good. I had three book. You had three book. And then it comes down to what all chess games come down to. Uh, I had four inaccuracies. You had three inaccuracies. I had four mistakes. You had three mistakes. And then we both had a blunder a piece. So we both had a blunder. Um, analysis sales. Book, 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 book. All good. And then I'm going to go way off book. I know I got super aggressive. And I was just trying my best to just harass you and take you out of a comfort zone. And it looks like black has a 0.76 advantage here. 0.78, slowly growing. We're just playing regular moves here. You almost have a full point on me. Uh, what's happening here? So I fall back, that's fine. Oh, they hated this move. So when I moved my rook to E1, it immediately dropped me down to a whole, a whole point deficit. They really wanted me to double up on this bishop, on this pawn. So they wanted bishop to e4, e3 to double up on this pawn. I guess. Uh, 0.65 advantage. Oh! So Barney, this is your first question mark. They really wanted you to scoot your king over. Why did they want king h8? Do you know? They're very afraid of queen g3, which I think is what I played. No, I did, play, I did queen h3. Bishop f4, and then queen g3 combination on that diagonal. Yeah, but isn't that just solved with this push here? No, bishop f4. So they just want me to get rid of this. Yeah, I see the pin. But I think you just push pawn. And you're fine. Bishop e6 becomes weak if I even push f6. That's true. He's very trapped behind the pawns. And you can't play to d6 or anything's defense because of my knight. That's interesting. So I played here and they hated that. They thought that was terrible. I should have played g3, which is what we were just talking about. So if I go g3, I pin the knight, bring up the bishop to uh, pin it even better. Yeah, I see that. And that's something I was wanting to do at some point. I do remember thinking I wanted an attack on your queen here. I never looked at the pin. I didn't think it was as valuable as it looked. So I go for the cheap mate threat. Super cheap, pointless mate threat. You trade out. Actually, they didn't like the trade out so much. They wanted just the simple pawn push. The game is still pretty much even. Pretty much even at this point. What they really wanted you to do is kick my bishop, though. They wanted the bishop to get kicked. And he did just kind of sit there. And I was afraid to cap here. I did not want to cap this pawn. Because I just didn't want to open up the fury of your queen and these rooks over here. You double up. Uh, they still want you to kick me. They hate my bishop sitting on g5. They hate it. Um, I lock this down. Um, I was really nervous about my bishop being trapped back here for the rest of his horrible life. But I, I had plans, of course, to connect the rooks over here and get them on the center and uh, try and slide the bishop out this way, which I did eventually. And they're still begging you, man. They're still begging you for that h6 kick. Game is still relatively even. Uh, they... 
they actually wanted me to do the bishop move before the rook move, which traps my rook. That seems dumb. I don't see why I would do the bishop move and trap my rook in. That doesn't make any sense to me. You know, the light square bishop was stronger, so you wanted to shut it down first before the dark square. No. Uh, fair enough. Because the dark square bishop doesn't really have anywhere to go except for back home. All he can do is just go to e3 or d2 or all the way back to c1, which is just garbage. It means nothing, really. Oh, how long was the message? There's no way it was that long. That's weak. Um, two sentences? That's two sentences too many. How dare you? How dare you bog down the chat with two sentences? Too many? Mm -mm -mm. I honestly hated this move. I did not think this was good. I did not enjoy this move. I thought it was very, I don't know, just locked your bishop up a lot. Even when you put the queen behind it, I, I just didn't think it was going to do the job, you know? I slide here. I bet you they hate me taking this knight. I bet you chess.com is like, you are a moron. Blunder. Ay! I'm not a moron, and it's not a blunder. Shocking. Shocking. So you recap, they preferred you take with the F pawn. And that's what I would have done too. I would have F pawned. I totally would have done the F pawn. Just to open this up even more on my king. Put the rook over here, slide him onto F or back on F. I think that would have been great. This rook move is trash? Really? I don't get it. Why queen here? Oh, to push pawns? Barney, are you seeing this? I think they want me to do queen to g4 so I can push the h pawn. Right? Probably. Bishop d2. King h7. Rook e3. Oh, and then rook lift. They wouldn't be that. They want me to bring the bishop back first, then rook lift. Okay. They still want my bishop on f. Oh, they love this move. They thought this was fantastic. Your e4 move? I like it too. Very strong. This move is excellent, but they want my rook back home. Yeah, you're right. You are correct. They want me to put my bishop back here to a... I don't like that so much. Yeah, that's exactly what they're wanting me to do. They want my rook back on e3, but it feels too passive. And they hated this. They wanted me to go all the way back to e2, once again, back on e5. They really want me to cover this e5 square. I just kept waiting for this kick, though. Yeah, I 100% was, Barney. I was absolutely throwing Hail Marys nonstop. That's all I was doing. I was going to try and just pressure you, pressure you, pressure you as much as possible. Okay, so like that's what I was just talking about. This f6 push... I was waiting for this to hit me like a ton of bricks forever. I was like, F6, F6, F6. Uh, and this is the point where chess.com finally thinks F6 was the best move. They did not like this so much. They actually wanted me to take? After bishop sack? I was planning a bishop sack. I was looking for a bishop sack 
for years. That's all I wanted. I just wanted to sack Bishop so hard. I really did. I was just going to try and blow you up as much as possible. So they want me to do a queen trade. Queen takes queen. Bishop takes. Rook e1. Back with that e... E file action. Bishop c6. Okay. I guess. What? Am I reading that wrong? Nope. Bishop c6. Rook e1. Bishop c6. Interesting. Alright, so I avoid that. And look at this. Let's see if the stream can see it. Yeah, they can. So, if you don't know a lot about chess, and you're just kind of watching this analysis, if you watch this bar here, this is just like a visualization of who's winning at any point. So right now it's about even, almost dead even, between black and white. I play this move, and I'm the white bar. I am obviously eating trash at this point. Just eating so much trash. This was a mistake. They hated it. And I was looking... I knew I trapped my bishop in, for sure, but I didn't really care. But this is a huge advantage to switch to uh, black in this position. And they, they still want you to trap my bishop. And he is, he's totally open to be trapped forever, because he has nowhere to go, it's a free bishop. But push, bishop sack, queen recaptures. And I'm just kind of behind you, but what can I do? Your bishop here is just a monster. I guess I could do... No, he's just a monster. Your bishop is a, just a, a god among gods on f5. Uh, I save the rook, of course. And... Blunder! Barney, do you see this? They hate this move. And I thought this was super clever. I thought this was great. I was actually super impressed with how you found a way to uh, trade the queens. I thought it was great. Um, they wanted you to play f6 still. Let's see what they think would happen. They think that queen takes, and then g takes, and then bishop f6 is the play. Bishop f6? Oh, okay, yeah, that's what I did. Right? That's exactly what I did. Um, bishop f6, bishop g6. I don't know, man. I thought that was super clever the way you did that. Takes, takes. Oh, I missed the move at first. I don't remember why I played this. Yeah, I had no choice. I had to trade there. But I think the computer is saying that he didn't have to trade there. He should have just taken my bishop for free. Or for a pawn or whatever. Um, yeah, they are hating these moves, man. <laughs> Chess.com hates this. So I should have played here to f6 instead of here. Which, whatever. I think either way I go, it's the same outcome, honestly. Same outcome, either way. I don't see how it's a different outcome. They really wanted the king lift here. I take f6 just to make them happy. Barney hits here, which is smart. Busting me open, starting to do the pawn trade game. Takes, 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 takes. And they hate this. I was down to 16 seconds. Now, if you don't trade, then you could take with the bishop. If I don't trade... Oh, yeah. I see what you're saying. 
but I didn't want to uh, change the bishop's position yet. So here, I had 16 seconds left, and I thought until I had 7 seconds, and I just gave up and traded rook for bishop. What did they want me to do? Oh, they wanted rook a3. Oh, because it's a mate threat. That's what they wanted, right? The mate being a3, a8, h8. But you never would have allowed that ever. Look at this panic chess. Look at this panic chess that I'm playing. I pre-moved like 20 moves in a row, and this was a pre-move drop. So I was pre-moving Barney and dropped. Weak. I pre-moved my Rook to death. Anyway, man, that was a fantastic game, Barney. You're awesome, bro. If you ever want to catch a game, let me know. I'll be happy to play a couple with you. You're a very strong player, and I like the way your brain works. You have a good brain, sir. Very good brain. You really made me test my chest berries. All right, so let's get back to, you know what? Forget it, let's go. I think I'm warmed up. I'm pretty sure I'm plenty warm after Barney put me through my stuff. Oh yeah, Barney, right on, dude. I'll check you out. I didn't realize you're a streamer. Hey, before you go, Barney, before you go, before you go, I got something for you. All right. You beat me in chess. But can you beat me in a duel? Let's fight to the death. Do hashtag or uh, exclam accept? Let's see what happens. You beat me in chess, but will you beat me in this? No! Barney! Barney! Why are you invincible? Why are you invincible? <laughs> I don't get it. Why are you invincible? Easy clap. All you do is the easy claps, man. You are killing me. God. All right, man. I'll get you next time. I will get you next time. And your little, little claps, too. Man. You couldn't let me have one thing. You can't let me have one nice thing. You are the devil, sir. I'm about to play the most boring games you've ever seen in your life, though. These 15-minute games just wreck my soul. Ugh. But my rating is so non-reflective. I hate it. Spawn, it's still a god. Once a god, always a god. I'm actually gonna add some god levels at some point. Playing some weird chess, boys. Ooh. I can hit him with a check. I don't think I will. Check. Protect. How do I want this to go? There's something I can do here and I know it. Fork, take, take. No. I think I'm going to allow the knight to die.
I'm gonna allow the knight to die. And then I'm gonna harass this knight. No, let's fall all the way back. Let's go all the way back home. Yeah, I have two different uh, uh, point counters. I have the Streamlabs, Streamlabs point counter, and then I have uh, Streamlabs chatbot, I think, as a point counter. This guy just won my knight. He took my knight for free, and then immediately just dropped his knight. Yo, Murdoch, have you tried the slot machine yet? I haven't seen anybody try the slots. Okay, well, guess I suck. I can't gamble, man. I'm not a gambler. I lose every freaking time. I hope he takes with Queen. I really hope he takes with Queen. Perfect. Now what am I gonna do about it? I had a plan. I had a plan. I guess I have nothing though. Man, these 15 minute games are slow. Ooh, Murdoch gets rocked on the slots. Nice try, homie. Nice try. I'm almost out of chest berries. I'm very low on them. I've already eaten half a pint of blueberries. I'm a monster. Did you bet 150? All right, Spawn. This dude flexing how much money he's got at all times. Is this a good move? It doesn't feel good. I, th I think there's a cooldown, Spawn. And you definitely need it because you have a gambling problem. Oh, look at what this guy's doing. So he's going for that old trick. He's going to put the bishop on H. And then once the bishop is there, he's going to try and checkmate me here or force me to lose my rook. I am not a fan of either one of those actions. So I will prevent it swiftly and easily with this move, then I'll get hit by that knight. I really don't want to get hit by that knight. How else can I prevent it? This knight move? Yeah, fair enough. Actually, any knight move would have worked. Because it pins the, pins the bishop. Yeah, knight move. Uh, this is not a real threat, so that's a fake threat. I don't know what he's doing here. Uh, I actually don't mind this check if I can land it. If I can land this check, it's pretty good. So, knight here check. It's pretty solid. This ruins that plan completely. But what can I do? I want to do something more. Let's get two attackers on my knight. I need to add another one. Another defender. Or I need to run. I think I'll just run. That feels weak though. Here, here, here. I'll go here. I'm gonna go with the full retreat, reassess my position, fix my life, you know.
goes for a rook trade. I will take it. Does he let me get a check? Does the rook trade come with a check? It does. Rook trade comes with a check, y'all. How do I wish to do it? Let's check him here. Here, 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 check. His bishops are very powerful, by the way. I'm kind of a little bit nervous about those bishops. I can force a queen trade. I have one pawn advantage, so... Oh, crap, heist. Let's go. Heist up. I'll do it for 100. First heist of the stream for 100. Let's rock it. All right, so he's going to put his rook here and hit me if I don't do something. So I'm going to play here. It's going to block the rook, so it's not an attack on the queen. And then I need to slide my rook somewhere more productive. I don't know where yet, though. I do not know where yet. I'm going to push this pawn to cut the legs off his knight. Because now his knight can't go to B or D. And I have a little support system for my knight so I can attack if I want to. Oh! Oh! Everyone dies except for me! Sorry about your puny gods. Okay, so this is almost exactly what I wanted him to play. He could play knight here, which I don't want him to play. So if he plays knight here, if knight goes here, I'm here, I discover where, where do I go? I think I have to allow this. I can't allow this move, so I have to sit here and die. Travesty. Uh, my rook will develop pretty well here. I'm going to set my queen free. With this move. I'm going to pre-move that capture if he takes it. Alright, so he immediately did not want this pawn to drop. Good job. I hate you. This bishop and this queen are working together super well. How do I punish this, though? Is this a thing? Big lag. Yeah, you're right. I think I should catch it up. Yeah, I got you, bro. Hey, thanks for letting me know. Appreciate that, Mr. Angel. That's why they call you Angel. That's why you're an angel. Archie the Angel. Okay, so we got a bishop looking here at G2, a bishop looking here at h2 both of these things are scary 
and unacceptable. Uh, we can try and get rid of the queen by putting the rook on a5. The problem is she scoots forward here, threatening mate. And if she's here, can I stop that mate? I don't know. Okay, so <clears throat> our plan here is to not get checkmated. That's the new plan. I guess push pawn, bishop takes, no. Man, I'm like legit worried right now. Let's do this. Let's try and get rid of this bishop. So if we can shake the bishop, we can take away one of his mating squares. And if he does go for the mate threat instead of dealing with this problem, which he probably will, if he goes for a mate threat here, here, anywhere on G. All right, so he's going for the mate threat. He's ignoring my counter. I take with check. And now I can block this mate threat, which he believes that I don't see. How many ways do I have to block it is the question though. I will block it this way and this doesn't work. Bishop takes, bishop takes, no problem. Yeah, he saw it. Man, I wanted this guy to suck. Why doesn't he suck more? Okay, so if this is our problem, then we have to deal with it. Let's go. We're going to kick the queen. We're going to kick the queen. This is getting very scary, by the way, guys. I don't know if you can tell, but I'm nervous. This is a very evenly uh, rated game. We both have similar ratings. I feel like I've played this guy, Konomi, before. I could force a queen trade. So if I do queen here, Queen F4 check. Forces a queen trade. Maybe that's a move. It's a rough, rough spot. But I'm thinking about doing the queen trade just to kind of like clear the field. So check, queen takes, knight takes. I still have the queen trade. I'm afraid of this rook. Honestly, it's terrifying me. So. I really think I'm going to go for the queen trade. No choice. No choice, boys. No choice, boys. Let's clear the field. Let's get away some of these threats. Threats need to get out of here. Now his bishop is in trouble. Because it's not pinned anymore, there's no more pin. Bishop is in real danger, not fake danger. He had to run. I'm going to set myself up for a discovered attack. He denied my discovered attack. Very smart. Rook here is a little weird. I could play here, knight here, this gets me... Let's try it. Let's try it. Because if I can get to d5, I can get a threat on e7 for a fork. I'm pretty sure that's not bad. But I need this rook off this file. Okay, so this is kind of expected. I thought this would happen. Let's play here. He's going to fall here, he'll go e3, and then we'll hit here. So 
So after e3, we hit here, we get an attack on the rook. He's going to take pawn. We'll hit this check, knock out the bishop. But we're going to be losing pawns like crazy. Oh, he didn't do it. Weird. Um, okay. Takes. Takes. Bishop takes. Threat on rook. Push. Takes. Yeah, that's what I'm looking at right now. So if I push pawn to c5, takes. That's no good. I need a hard threat. So if I can cover this square, if I can cover f7 and get the rook on the back rank, it's a checkmate. How do we do it though? I need the rook to cover this. I need to take this pawn. All right, let's play it out. Let's go. Takes, bishop takes, rook here. No, I can't drop knight. I play here. This knight is depending on my rook. So after bishop caps, oh, he had pawn caps. That seems wrong. Okay, here I can defend the pawn that was going to get dropped a second ago. He could fall back. He's going to attack here again. That's fine. We could play... I feel like this is an opportunity do something. Here, if I play here, he's going to play bishop here. I can hit with the check. I don't love it though. I don't love it. Man, this is rough. This is rough. Okay, so this was expected. Do I check right now? If I check right now, king moves up. Check again. I'm gonna try and force the king onto a square where I can check in with my knight. He's not gonna allow it. Let's play here. The idea is bait. If he plays too quickly here, I can get a good fork. If he plays too quickly. But I don't think he will. Meaning rook takes pawn, knight d5 fork. But I am in a... Well, the d5 fork doesn't really work because of the stupid bishop. Maybe here? Check. I don't know. I don't love it. I'm fairly certain I'm about to lose 21 points. And I'm barely going to be clinging onto 1300. Which is terrible. So this just like goes to show you the power of the centralized bishop. Yeah, he's totally going to take it. And he did. He needs to. This fork would be the best thing in the world. But good things come to anyone that's not me. So check. Check. I'm just gonna harass him. I'm gonna actually try and check him into a draw. That's my goal. If I can get a threefold repetition, 300? What do you think you're made out of, man? You made out of Laffy Taffy? 
I'll go 50. I'm not betting 300. Yeah, Milton, I saw that. But... What does it do for me right now? So I'm very worried about, obviously, everything in the world. I want to try and get a threefold. I probably, but you know what, Milton? I think you're right. I probably should have just taken the pawn while I could have. I should have just taken it. You're right. You are correct, Milton. I feel like I've seen you on here before. Have I seen you in the stream before, Milton? You seem familiar. Uh, man, everything sucks. Everything sucks. Do I play here and defend this pawn? Weak. I've definitely seen you before. Maybe I've seen you in another stream or something. All right, let's grab this check. Uh. That's what chess is all about. Annoying checks that get nothing done. 59 seconds. What do we want? You went alone? This is important. If he goes up, I got a discover attack on him. He has to choose wisely here. Discover attack. I want this check so bad. Check. Check. Take. Let's go with this. Let's just keep harassing him. Pawn takes, I check him again. Oh, who forgot the space? Oh, me! I forgot the space. That is embarrassing. 14 seconds. Mm. Nine seconds to five minutes. How's this going to turn out? Not good, I'll tell you that. Not good. Dude, my chest berries are not working at all. Dang, man. I suck. What? Okay, I'm gonna rematch this guy if he'll let me. Okay. He declined me. Can't blame him. Forky's gonna fork, man. Forky's gonna fork. Alright, what's happening over here? Let's get... Let's get a heist going then, since you went by yourself. Let's get a heist going. Oh, you want to fight? Well, let's heist first, and then we'll fight. I'm going to heist out for 300. Let's go. Is it not letting me heist 300? Do I not have 300 to spare?
Maybe that was too big of a too big of a bet. All right, now I'm gonna fight you then, Spawn. Let's go, Archie. I'll fight you for two hundred. Oh, it's just the global cooldown. That makes sense. All right, we got a two hundred duel with the mod Spawn Archangel, the mod god. Ha! Huh. And that's what happens. That's what happens. Get wrecked, sir. Get wrecked. Get wrecked. The only thing I can win is stupid duels right now. I can't win any of these chess games. Let's go for a new 15. Oh, do you want to play? You didn't tell me you wanted to play? Uh, all right. Let me get through this game, and then we will throw down. I hope this guy gives me a bishop here. Dang! Not this crap again. Ugh, so boring. Alright, he's castled up. Uh... How are we going to harass this guy? Let's go with here first. To connect the knights. This way if he takes, I'll take back. Um, we could do either one, man. Whichever one you prefer. I don't know if you have chess a chess.com account. I'm pretty sure you mostly play uh, on lead chess. But I can do that. Oh, we got the heist going? Alright, man, I'm going biggie on that. I want 300. I want 300 creds. And I want the now. Uh, this bishop's backing up. That is interesting. If push takes, takes. I kind of dig that. I kind of dig that. But I really want to castle queen side, so... Let's try to rock this queenside castle and get out of this mess. Or create a new mess, I don't even know anymore. Results, Spawn Archangel, Unrated Chess, and Matthew Murdoch. Kit, you bet one? You bet one? That's how little faith you had in the heist? Unbelievable, sir. This is getting hairy already. You got those two creds, sir. Two creds. You should be proud. This is very hairy right here. Just so you know. This rook check could come, then bishop has to block on e7. If this trade goes through. But I do not know. I do not know what to expect. Oh, he didn't do it. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and take my castle. I just need to get my queen out of here now. Queen needs to go... Literally anywhere. I just gotta get out of here. I think I wanna go here to F5. 
I think. I think I go F5. I don't want to get trapped though. I feel like this bishop coming here is a big problem for me. This feels like a problem. Alright. Oh, he didn't play that though. He didn't do the bishop back here for the threat. He's... I actually don't understand. I don't know why he played here. So I broke this pin, which means my knight can move again. Fantastic, right? Uh, this knight can't move. So I could do a, a take, take, and bust open his king side. Let's do it. So the plan here is queen takes, queen trade, g takes, his king is open, and now we're going to punish that as much as possible. As much as possible. So I think step one, I'm going to try and break this open. If I can get a trade off here, it's going to open up my g file, I'm going to put a rook on it and just dominate him. If he pushes pawn, I'm going to have to push rook. Yeah, I push rook, and then I can cap pawn. The only thing he could do here is this, possibly. Or... Bishop threat. Develop the bishop to a better square. I think that's probably the best move. Let's see. I like that answer. That works for me. I'd rather be a vampire than be beaten by... Archie. This feels weird, but okay. So this is a big weakness. I need to hit F3. Somehow, somewhere. Knight, 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 knight. I have got to get to F3. Knight, knight, pawn push. Okay, let's start here. Oof, this fork looks so gross if he lands it, but it's not possible. One thousand? Alright man, I'll join you, but... I think we've gotten too much money and too lucky as a whole, I don't think you're going to get a thousand. I think that is some wishful thinking, bro. You about to lose a lot of money, son. For reals. Uh, the threat here is simple. I'm going to kick this knight. If he checks me, easy correction here. Uh, if rook comes here, that's a little bit more of a problem. If he slides a rook, that is a bigger problem. No, it's not. If he slides a rook, I just take the knight. No one cares. Super easy. Oh, he's sacking. What does he get from that? What am I missing? And Murdoch gets murdered. Murdered. I told you not to do it. I told you. Why don't you listen to me, man? I told you not to do it. The gods do not smile upon you, sir. 
You do not live inside of their light. Uh, I don't love having my king here, but I don't hate it. Maybe I should have blocked with bishop, right? I think bishop blocks was the answer. Oh, I didn't even see that. What's the top look like? I haven't looked at that in a while. Top. Me with 5,388. Matthew Murdoch with 3,400. A 10, whoever that is. Another TV viewer. Streamlabs. Zeus. Bot God. Nightbot. Look at all these clowns. Nothing. None of these people are real people. I'm going to have to put them on a block list or something somehow. Or zero them out. All right, what's happening in the game? Uh, he pawn pushed on me. That is totally fine. I do not care. I'm going to go where I wanted to go to begin with. Here. And now I have an outpost for my knight. I'm going to live here for the rest of my night life. He is going to hate this. But I do hate his bishop pair. It's very annoying. And I'm on my way to drop my rook here and start wrecking some shop. Or I could double jump this and kick the bishop. I think that's the next play. I'm gonna double jump kick bishop. You're going big? You just went big. You went a thousand. You went one thousand, sir. Is that not big? Oh, he already moved. I didn't realize he moved. Uh, he pushes pawn. He pushes pawn. It's kind of a fork situation. Don't love it. I don't love it. Um, takes. How do I handle this? Here? What happened? Oh no! I got super lucky. For some reason it called, it made a pawn move onto g6. I don't remember dropping a g6 pawn. I did not make that move. That was an idea I looked at. That's not an idea I did. I got insanely lucky. He had a very, very strong move that he missed right there. Bro. I got very lucky. Dude, that really sucked. I'm kind of annoyed by that. Uh... I gotta kick this bishop. So I would have done g5. I wasn't mad at g5, but g3 or g6 is stupid. I would never play that. Uh, what's the idea? What's the idea? Bishop check here. Is that mate? That is mate. So he's got a mate threat on me. I'm gonna go ahead and stop it. Cut it off at the knees. And I really, really, really... Wait, what's he doing now? What's that do? Nothing? I'm gonna get this bishop out of here before something bad happens. Okay, bishop has been scooted. I need my bishop to do literally anything. Get in the game, bro. How do I do it, though? I'm low on time, like always. Uh, first, I think I play bishop here. And then push pawn, push pawn. Okay, so he cut off that. 
he has a threat on this, which is not protected. He's not wrong. It's a good idea. It's a good threat. I play here. He may think he has a discovered attack with this, but then I just take the rook. He takes my rook, I take his bishop. And I think I'm fine. I am nervous though, this is bad. What does check get me here? Does it get me anything? Nope, gets me killed. Rook take or bishop takes me. Play here. Alright, I'm gonna get out of this hole. This is a problem. 2400? Is it even letting you at this point? Ugh, God. Dude, there's so many problems all over this entire board right now. If I can stay alive, I can win this game. Who that? Who that? Who that? Kusi? Kusi? Thanks for the follow, Kusi. You are now a demigod. Oh, Coochie. Coochie Datu. Datu. I want, I want to call you Datu. I like Datu. Italian. Are you an Italian? Do you play the Italian? The Italian opening in chess? I love the Italian opening. It's actually my favorite. And you play the Sicilian defense. Of course you do. Oh, bro, I just stepped into a pile of doo doo. I play here, pawn takes, 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 takes. Everything's fine. Everything's cool, guys. I got it under control. You go, and you're from Sicily? Look at you. This guy's trading down on me. I'm from Houston, Texas. I'm a Texas chess player. We do not have... Ooh! Homeboy just made a big mistake. That's the blunder that loses this kid the game. Ah, uh, I was hoping he would do that. I was hoping he would miss this. You get your account set up? Awesome, man. Add me as a friend, bro. Oh, screen's frozen? Man, thank you for telling me that. My mods be slipping on me sometimes. Let's go first to... And then let's go to... Done. Alright, screen is updated. No, you're right though. The screen, the game got frozen and then this dude just completely dropped a rook. I'll run it back. So the position was something like this, and it was getting very, very, very hairy. Takes me, threatens rook. I offer a rook trade, like a gentleman. And I also need to block the b7 square because this check was just a nightmare. Rook takes on a b7. Uh, he checks me again. I got extremely nervous, thought I was done for. Knight blocks. He trades the rooks out. And he thinks he has a free knight. Thinks he has a free knight, but then I slide up with the sneaky bishop. And here we go. Now we got a chess game, sir. Oh, I totally won the exchange. And I'm very happy about it. But these pawns are a little bit annoying. 
and his bishops are placed beautifully. He has some beautiful bishops, not gonna lie. Uh, he's gonna start pushing this pawn for sure. I could attack it. I attack the pawn, he pushes pawn. I play here to e5 with knight. Then knight here. And I trap the bishop. Yep. Let's trap his bishop. Oh no! Discovered attack. I lose the knight and I'm in check. No! But I got this. It's okay. It's okay. Exactly. Block with knight. Tattoo! Right here. Right here. Right here. Brain Brothers. Brain Brothers. He's going to keep pushing this and it's going to really annoy me though. Oh, king. Alright. If he wants to move kings, let's move kings. Maybe. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and break that pin because I can't live my life like that. This knight needs his legs. I guess next I can push pawn. Threaten bishop. Pawn push, threaten bishop. Pawn push again. Check fork. Yeah, I get a fork here. Yeah, man, you gotta let those Mustangs roam. But I win a bishop, I think, no matter what in this position, right? No, check. You forgot to check, I think. Unless I unless I missed that. No, my bishop defends. My bishop has this covered. My knight was safe the whole time. Uh, the only problem I have right now is these pawns are dastardly. I'm about to snag this pawn, but I'm hanging this pawn. I don't think you got the creds for it, Murdoch. B takes D4 followed by B takes F4. B takes D4. Uh, he could have done bishop takes, I take bishop. So he still would have lost the bishop either way. But this would have been better. You're right, if you would have taken the knight now. I wouldn't have such a big piece advantage. Okay, I need to work this though. Oh, look at this. Yoink. Yoink. That's a fork, eh? Fork. That's my favorite character in Toy Story. Forky. He's very relatable to me. Beautiful. Alright, Spawn Archangel, you said that you wanted to play? I am on Lee Chess also. I've just been playing a whole lot of uh, chess.com lately. I got a uh, challenge with Spawn Archangel waiting. Send me a challenge uh, on... Actually, I'll send you one. What's your name on here? Are you Spawn Archangel again? If you want to get a game in, uh, Datu, I'm down. Let me just play uh, spawn first. Got you, boo. Alright, I just sent you a challenge. It says that you are not currently... Oh, whoop, oh, whoop, oh, whoop. Oh. Here we go. All right, I just sent you a friend request also. All 
All right, how are you playing this game? What's your What's your game plan, son? Heist won't let you go so big, I guess. Uh, I guess I'll play this. Let's go. All right, that, sir, was what we call a mistake. That is what we call a mistake. Let me prove it to you. Let me prove it to you. I'm not positive, but I think it was a mistake. No. No. Get that bishop out of here. No. I've just been snacking these chest berries so hard. Ooh, interesting choice. I think you're going to lose a lot of stuff here, though. I think you're going to lose a lot of stuff here, bro. I don't... I don't think you're going to love what's about to happen. I think you're going to hate what I'm about to do. A lot. You're going to hate it a whole lot. Yoink! That's not a spoon, not a knife, but uh, a fork. Uh, he saw it though, he pre moved it up. I respect that pre move. Oh, I can't do that. I respect the pre move. Not a spoon, not a knife, but a fork. It's a four, okay. For Chad. Is that hey, is that how you say fork in uh, Italian? Or are you just messing with me? For Chad, that's how you say for the cut. Fork, forch, forchetta. It won't let you move. I thought I saw you playing five minute games. We could do a longer time control if you want. But ch is in time is hard. It's hard sound like a k and cookie. So, forketta? Is it forketta? Forketta. Bro, I'm so glad you hopped into the stream. You're going to teach me how to speak the language of my favorite chess opening. Forketta. I'm about to start forketting everyone I did play. All right, what do we got? What do we got? There has to be a move here. Yeah, uh, spawn. Just tell me whatever time control you prefer. Sack the queen. I thought about it. I'm not gonna lie. Not gonna lie to you. Ten minute. We can do some tens. Let's go ahead and get a little. Let's get a little rook into the game. Forge cat. You don't know why? Um. Uh. Check, please. Check, please. Um. Uh. I'm 
feel like I'm missing something here. Something is happening, and I don't know what it is. Uh... I'm missing something. Let's start with this. Let's start here. Let's start with this and try and get this knight out of my face. Okay. That lets me bring my rook into the game. This is a free bishop if I want it. But instead of the free bishop... Don't take back. No, you had... Mate. Datu. Alright. I'll do Datu and then spawn. I'll come back to you on a 10 minute, okay? The spawn is not a 5 minute guy. I had queen c4, mate. So Spawn likes the 10 minute games. I'll do a 10 against you in a second. Uh, let's see what's up with uh, Datu. Check. Takes. QC4. You are correct, Datu. You are correct. I was thinking too simply. I just saw the ladder threat here. I was like, two rook mate. Basic. Basic. All right, let's go with, let's find this guy. Let's find Datu. Let's find Datu. Got him. All right, it says that you're idle right now. But I got a challenge coming your way. All right, Datu, what's up? Let's go. Oh, 1700. Let's rock it, baby. Here comes the Sicilian opening. I think we saw that coming. Hmm. How do I feel like playing this? How do I feel like playing this? Okay. I'm not sure what I want to do here. I'm going to get real weird, though. If I play there, that happens. Chess math. It's the quickest and the dirtiest of all the math types. Mm. Let's just see what happens. Let's play crazy. Let's go. Uh, ideas, ideas, ideas. I don't see any great ideas just yet. Let's just play some chess. See what happens. That's a little spooky. I'm not gonna lie. I'm a little spooked by that move. I could play a simple move. Or I could play a terrible move. Simple move? Oh, we got a duel going? Let's duel out then, bro. And I lost 30 creds. That's my life, man. That is my life. <sighs> Pushes on night. I kind of thought he would. I kind of thought he would. 
let's try and cause him some problems here too. Okay. Okay. I see what you're up to, bro. I see you. I don't want it to happen. Ugh! Ugly. This is a very good game, though. This is good, Datu. Datu's got moves. Like Jagger. Bam 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 Let's get crazy then. It's a fun one for sure. Oh Datu. Oh Datu. How are we gonna do this, bro? Here first? And then we do the takes here. You're making me think, man. I can't even talk out my moves. I have to think very hard each time I make a move. This is very uncomfortable. Alright, so we knew that was going to happen at some point. Can I retaliate though? Can I hit him with a check first? I'm going to hit him with a check first. Dude, you can't... <laughs> There must be a limit on the heist. There must be. When in doubt, check them out. I hate chess. Matthew Murdoch, I hate chess. Terrible game. No, never mind. It's a beautiful game. I thought I missed a move and I got very upset. Like, hardcore upset. Okay. Oh, my heart was pumping. All right, knight moves, attack on queen. What else we got going on? What else do we have going on? Anything good, anything bad, anything ugly? I feel like there's plenty of ugliness on this chessboard. Oh, uh, Datu, I, I was, I planned too far ahead, man. So I looked at, I looked at a move, like, you know, like if you get into a move hole and you start looking at moves too much to where they're not even freaking there. That's basically what I did. Uh,
check check first check oh no oh I'm so stupid I'm so bad at chess man Oh, oh, G G G G G G G. Datu coming all the way from Italy, battling a a Texan. Man, that's that's one for the 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 heart health center. You had my heart beating. Hey, man, you lost this time, but that was a tight, 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 tight game the entire time. Uh, you had me on such a weird defensive mode. And I had to play some weird moves. And I was very afraid of uh, this square. I was so scared with C2. Oh, yeah, most deaf, man. I'm really glad you, you came into the stream. You know your stuff. Um, I was terrified of C2. I did not want your rook to get here. And as soon as your knight landed on C6, you, you solved so many problems for me. So knight C6 uh, made me feel so much better about the C2 threat. Um, I did miss mate, though, right here. So I had mate. Queen h8 mate. I had it. And I panicked. Yeah, so I think knight c2. So I wasn't worried about knight c2 so much as rook c2. Rook c2 is what scared me. So when you tried to open up this uh, c file. Oh, crap, man. That's so annoying. Alright, let me fix it. That is super annoying. Oh, it's straight up gone too, man. It is like straight up gone. Let me see if I can find where it wants to be. Yeah, it's being weird. Give me one second. I'm going to go BRB and fix this real quick. Let's see. We'll go BRB. I'm going to try and fix this real quick. I'll be right back. Let's just see if this one works. Streamlabs is honking out on me. All in ones. I feel you, man. It's like a party screen. It is just straight up not picking up Chrome at all. So I'm going to go to knock this game out. Let's see if that fixes stuff. It's like not responding to chess.com at all.
Super weird, man. All right, so I'm going to... Maybe I have to launch through here. Or let's go here. Dude, it's super weird. It's not even showing Chrome as an option, so sorry about this, guys. It's huge technical difficulties right now. All right, let's take that. Let's go with that. Big Camzy. What's up, homie? I haven't seen you in a minute, son. Big Cams. What's up, bro? Hey, Datu, you still here, man? What's up, man? Blake is exactly right. All right, Spawn. I'm going to challenge you to a game, Spawn. Let's go. Let's go, Archie. We'll do a 10. Not rated. Are hey, you ready? Archie, you ready for a game? There he goes. All right, so you didn't like five minute. Let's see what happens with 10. Let's see what happens with 10. I'm very excited. Ah, uh, Datu had to roll out. It sucks. All right, let's do this let's do this let's see what you do with this all right archie so we got a 10 minute game going with spawn arch angel another viewer challenge i've done like four viewer challenges today my boy doing the night pawn sacrifice trick let me see i can hit him with a check Check take, check block. Let's just go for it. I'm cool with this. I'm cool with this. Archie's got tricks. But not all tricks go to heaven. Not all tricks go to heaven, Archie. I will check you first, sir. And then I will trade you, sir. And then I will... Mm, I wanted the fork so bad, I almost did it. I had to resist so hard. Let's go. Let's go G6. Cams, have you eaten your blueberries today? It's exactly how you say it. I'm a professional. All right. Feeling good, going good. You're all out. Mm. I just bought a fresh batch of berries today. 
and they're lightly misted. So that's the cool thing. You go get your berries at like the supermarket, right? And I, I like to get mine lightly misted with um, COVID-19. And it like really brings out natural, like organic flavors of the berries. It's it's the best. Seriously, it's incredible. You get you gotta try it. All right, so this guy wants to protect his pawn. Should I let him? If bloop, then bloop, then bloop, then bloop. How can I punish this behavior? How can I punish this bad behavior? Let's go ahead and get castled first. And then I will punish him. So punishment's coming. Oh, queenside? I actually did not expect you to go queenside. That is a powerful move. Much respect, sir. Much respect. But I'm still going to push on you. Oh, you got to try it. It's fantastic. Basically, anything in the fruit section or produce section is going to have that extra seasoning on it. It really redefines the term cough syrup. Like cough syrup, people like to pretend like it helps you, right? Like you got a cough, you take cough syrup, but man, the true definition of cough syrup is what they put on produce in supermarkets. That's real cough syrup. Where are we going, baby? Where are we going? We got a pawn picking fights with bishops. Anybody just checking in? I'm doing a lot of viewer challenges. So if you want to play, just hit me a follow and send me a challenge. I can play on uh, chess.com or Lee Chess. Whichever you prefer. And I'm going to eat blueberries the whole time. I'm blueberrying so hard. I don't know what kind of math problem you're working out over there, Archie. But it's not going to work. This is all I got left. Once I'm out of berries, I don't know if I can play anymore, man. This is the secret of my powers. Ooh, Bishop takes... Very aggressive, very sexy. Very aggressive, very sexy. Nice try, sir. A little too aggressive, a little too sexy. Do you want to rematch it, bro? Do you want to run it back? I'm going to rematch it. I'm going to send you another one. Let's go. That was a bold move, though, man. Sacking the bishop like that. That's, that's crazy bold. But I think bishop takes... Bishop takes, knight takes, and then I take your pawn... You're still playing fine. You're not playing poorly. Uh, my rematch, did, it says that Spawn Archangel did not respond. Try again later. I'm try again now. You just should have dropped your knight back. So knight should have hopped back after taking my pawn. So you cap pawn, and then I, uh, you hop your knight back so you can block the mate.
Oh, I almost mouse slipped. A mouse slip is like uh, a wardrobe malfunction, but way worse. Delicious. Good night, sweet prince. That just made the highlight reel. Just so you know, I'm highlighting that, and that's going to be the highlight for the night, is the two-move checkmate. That's that's highlight reel right there, man. <laughs> what are you doing, Archie? What are you doing? I don't trust you now. I'm not sure what's going on. I don't trust you, bro. I don't know what you're doing. I feel like something sneaky is happening that I don't understand. I don't trust you. I don't know what to do. You have broken my trust and I do not know what to do. Where is that night going? I don't understand. I'm very confused. I'm going to pin you up. I'm going to try and break you down. Pin you up and break you down. I just don't know how yet. Boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. Free pawn. Pin you up and break you down. This is our goal. Uh, there's a problem with that move. I just don't know what it is yet. Was that wrong? Should I not have played there? It felt okay. Whoa! That was a very surprising move. But I'm just gonna retreat because it was so surprising. I just gotta find how to take advantage of that king move. Because I know it, it couldn't have been correct. There's something wrong with it somewhere. I just gotta find it. If push on Passant, not good. Oh no. <laughs> I forgot all my own commands. Games. Play it.
All right, what do we have here? Okay, so we push this pawn here. That kind of limits the knight's mobility. So what am I going to do with it? Here? Maybe we push this. I think we push this. I think we try and open things up on the king side. I think that's kind of the goal. Open up the king side and line up some rooks over there. That feels like the idea. Right? Right? No? Yes? I think it works. Let's see if this ever got figured out up time. Two hours, 19 minutes and 36 seconds. It's not my record time yet. Ooh, all right, Archie. That feels risky. But you do got a risky for the bisky. That is true. I'm already ready for it, man. I'm ready for it. Give me, give me your best shot, bro. And I should have played that move. Or do I play it now? I can't get in there. All right, so if I can't get in there yet, I need more help. I've almost finished all my blueberries. I can't compete without blueberries. And this is the secret to losing so many games. It's so many blueberries. Alright, the angel is thinking. Making him think on this one. I know exactly the two squares that I want to be on so badly, but I cannot get there. I just can't. All right, queen comes in, looks like he's doubling up on this pinned knight. I don't enjoy that. That does hurt my feelings a little bit. I think it's a little bit rude. So. Because of that rudeness, I'll play here. So I'm going to cut him off from my knight. I definitely need... I definitely need to break that pin though. I need to move the king. Rook is on the move. I don't want him to move too much. Here? 
This sets this knight free and sets this knight free. Kind of. I don't know why I was so afraid of that double up. That was a mistake. Alright, so he's going for the rook trade here. I'm cool with that. Not as cool as I thought I was with it, but I'll make it work. How do I punish this though? Oh, there's something I've been missing the entire time? Has this always been here? This move has always been here. I've been missing something this whole time. So this uh, queen check on h4, queen check h4. How do I use this the best? Queen check h4, ting. Here, knight check. Let's infiltrate, let's go. Infiltration. So this check, I did see it earlier, but he had the knight block and now because the knight's on the back rank, I got check, followed by probably another check, actually guaranteed second check. There's no fork yet, but this should give me a discovered attack, I think. So after queen checks king, king goes to either f1 or e2, knight g3 check, king is forced back onto a dark square, and then I have a discovered attack which I will use my discovered attack to go. Oh, well, it's not a guaranteed discovered attack, but it's a highly likely discovered attack. Likeliness is not so much anymore. Check. Here with the fork. So I hit the fork here. Let's see if this works. I'm coming at him as hard as I can. Waiting to see what he goes with here. So I think after this game, I'm probably going to call it a night. But I want to try and do a raid. So I haven't raided the channel. We only have three people on here, so it's probably only actually like two people. But I want to try and see if we can do a raid. And make that work. I just want to figure out how to do it. That is my only plan is to learn. I want to learn. Okay. Rook goes here. Rook gets dropped. My bishop is super strong though, so that trade out for the bishop. Pretty fair for him. That was the wrong move. That was the wrong move. Let me see. Takes. That doesn't work, and I'm positive I can prove it. I'm gonna prove it. I'm gonna prove to you that that move does not work.
That was very precarious. I'm positive that I have a checkmate here. I just don't know where it is yet. Alright, King runs. Let's go ahead and take this check. We're very close to a checkmate. We are super duper close to a checkmate. Guaranteed checkmate now. I think King running would have saved his life. For a second. Mate. Man, good game, bro. Good freaking game, man. That was a lot stronger that time. There was still a lot of weird positions. It was very difficult, very odd. But you definitely made me think. You made me think a lot. That was solid, bro. You play so well against everyone else. Man, that's the story. That's how it works. Like, I mean, you've seen me play. You've seen me play like over a hundred games, probably. You've seen me play a ton of chess. And in person, like over the board, like I'm a lot better than I am on the internet. Like online, I'm not nearly as good. I'm much weaker uh, on the internet. But in person, you blame chess.com? That's funny. I mean, I'll play you on Lee Chess too. If you want to switch to there at some point, but no man, it's, it's just a different ball game. I don't know, it's very strange playing online versus playing in person and you can have great games, but sometimes you get some solid just monsters. I definitely am not as strong as I used to be. I wish I was. Alright, so what I want to try and do... You may have heard me, but I want to do a raid. Actually, I don't know if I can. I think maybe a raid is an affiliate thing. And I'm not an affiliate, so I can't. Yeah, you definitely played better at the 10 minute, 10 minute uh, time control versus fives. You played much better at 10. So Spawn, do you know if we can even... Oh, you could raid me. Yeah, you could raid me, but... Is it... Is it... Can I raid other people, or is that just affiliate? It's probably just an affiliate thing, right? Yeah, I thought so. All right, man. Well, then I'm going to call it. Call it a night on that. That was a pretty su successful stream. That was a lot of fun. You gave me a great highlight of the two-move checkmate, basically. Very fun. And it was a good time, man. And I have Fall Guys now, too, on PS4. I think I told you that, so... We'll have to get some Fall Guys going at some point. But that is it for me tonight. You guys have a great night. Thanks for coming out. Appreciate the follows I got from Datu. Kakuti, Datu, and Barney Claptrap. Both of you guys were solid freaking chess players. It was fun playing you. And I will see y'all next time.